Hello everybody, welcome back to another Trailmakers video. Today we are going to be doing something a little different than my usual videos, because in this video I'm going to spend some time looking at some of the community's most impressive creations. And today I'm joined by a master builder, the Mokix, and he's going to be showing us some of his best builds and creations. Hello everybody, I am the Mokix. I like to build a lot of replicas of aircraft from real life. I like to post on TikTok and everything like that. And this is my Lancaster bomber. And it's, it's three segments. It's, it's not just one big build. So basically, it's three separate builds that are all hooked together using pistons and anchor pins. Yeah, so this is three different builds. Um, obviously, the way you build is unconventional. Like, you, you do a lot of unconventional techniques in building that make your build super complex. So you've needed mm -hmm. to, you know, have separate parts of this build, I guess. So some cool features on this, almost all the turrets are movable except for the rear ones and uh the top ball turret does not have guns on it just because they didn't fit the aesthetic correctly but i'd say the most impressive part of this build is the fact that it's got working bomb bays and the it bottom. actually and functions as well yeah like i could drop the bombs right now but uh i wouldn't recommend doing that they'll uh they'll get in the way on takeoff if we were to take off <laughs> so the middle piece also has the bomb bay you can control the whole plane from the wing section but that's the part i'm in right now one thing i'd recommend to almost everybody is experiment with the decals because this will not only improve your builds like aesthetically but it will just boost like the whole aesthetic of it like you know everybody will be like wow that's cool i want to learn how to do that so <laughs> That's just something cool. And we are off. Oh, I gotta put the landing gear up. <laughs> so yeah, surprisingly, this thing flies very well for being three separate builds all hooked together. And many people would be asking, how does it fly so well? And um, how, do, how are you rolling and pitching? Well, since I have all the controls in the middle piece, the roll and pitch are actually on helicopter engines, which give me roll and pitch. Since you have three different parts of this build, you just need the middle part to control everything, like the roll, pitch, and yaw, and everything, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, uh, let's press RB and then press LB after, after like five seconds or so. And uh, after you do that, you can drop your bombs, and I'll just fall out of the bomb bay. <laughs> wow. So yeah, a cool, massive a, build that I A have. fully functioning, three-stage build with working bombays. That's super cool. All right, shall we see the next build? Sure. All right, so this is your second build here. It's a little shaky on the ground, but this is a replication of an Mi-28 helicopter. It's Russian. What I think is really cool about this that I managed to do is this is an odd width helicopter, but the rotor is, it's not an odd width. I just used a piston to center it, I, like center it in the aircraft. Another thing about this that is so cool is that it has collective on the blades and it relies solely on the blades to produce all the pit, like lift. So if I was to turn it on, it'll, I just have to use my collective to pitch up and then we're off. On an engineering level, that is amazing. Yeah. Another thing you guys probably have noticed, the fact that it's got a gun on the front. That's actually five guns, all glitching the one just to do that. It's got quite a bit of firepower for five guns, and the most uh, noticeable thing is it's got 12 bombs. I'll demonstrate how powerful they are. So like, if you were to do a whole cluster strike with these, and you're flying like this, it's very devastating if somebody is down there. <laughs> yes, very explosive. Another amazing build from the Markix here. Alright, the third and final build. So what is this? This right here is an F-18A Super Hornet. And what I believe is like the coolest thing I've done on this is I have a full ar like ordnance system. So I've got fuel tanks on each wing and a set of three bombs on each wing. Just look how detailed this is, guys. Look at look at the way he built the cockpit. Also, if you guys are wondering how the cockpit works, that's uh, that's just glass blocks, but it's got decals on it to make it look like the bracings inside the cockpit. Also, another thing that this does have is it's got a functioning air brake and tail hook on the back end. Oh, I can see the air brake. Wow. It's just so much attention yeah, I'll do, to detail. I'll do a bombing and flare demonstration because I actually managed to fit two flares in this thing. And that may shock some people because uh, this is a really complex plane. It, w it wouldn't look like it from the outside, but this thing is like 698 complexity, I think. Th this thing works really good for airstrikes and the bombs are fairly accurate, so this is what they'll do. Wow. And um, 
All right, so now a flare demonstration. We can, uh, I can fly, but like turn back around here, and do a little flyover. The flares, they just come right out the bottom. Well, I'm super impressed. I don't know about you guys. This this is just too advanced for me. Yeah, if you guys want to check me out on TikTok, I have um, a whole bunch of other builds if you want to check those. All right, guys, this has been a look at the Mokix's amazing creations. Uh, if you want to see more of his builds and check him out, do follow his TikTok. Uh, hopefully, the link will be down in the description below. And guys, let yeah. me know if you want to see more showcase videos like this one for a chance for you to show your creations in one of my videos. Anything else you want to say, Mokix? Thank you guys for watching and give this man a follow. He's always been a big inspiration of mine. He's the man. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, bro. Thank you. Yeah, if you like You're this welcome. video, make sure you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.